Yeah, hello, here we are about end time gardening. Here what we have made a little greenhouse. I've made it all myself and I'll show you a little bit how to do it and what we have done and what. It's winter, we put the plants in the winter in and what. We're already eating from the plants. So we have different kind of um, greens in here. We love eating greens. We have bok choy and pok choy. And then we have little um, cabbage plants in here. Some kind of uh, Chinese uh, broccoli. And so um, I've made this by, with two by fours. Under here I have some plastic and on top of it I have gravel with um, so stones with sand and above that I have natural dirt in here so that the plants can grow nicely and, um, and so what I've done I put hinges at the back so I, I got here PVC pipe and I made holes in here and st stick them through it and I put a nail through it so they can't move and then I put a layer of pl plastic over it and it's working really great right now I only have to give one time a week water because as you see the dome keeps the water in and the moist comes back onto the plants and so the plants are growing very very good so it's a, a little success and later on a the next property we're going to have a very big one so this one this small one you can just make big and have a big greenhouse now what's this one this is our littlest greenhouse watch these plants are ready to be transplanted so we have silver beet here and then we have the different kind of chinese cabbage here and so this is all started in the winter. I started the plants like this in here in the winter and then I transplanted it in here. And this is our second lot ready to go in here. And we're gonna take some of these plants now in our outside gardens. So they grow quick here and they will finish off there. Then I have more space again to put these in here. And so in this way, in the colder season, you will have food, yeah, because we've been eating already from it. Well, we planted it in the winter. We started everything in the winter. The good thing is here, bugs can't get to it, grubs can't get to it, and grasshoppers can't get to it. So if there's a grasshopper plague, like in Africa, in India and other places, and you have this kind of stuff, your food is safe. And so this is a great way, and it doesn't, and, and it takes way less water when you do it like this. So there's a lot of good, positive sides to having a little greenhouse. And then you can make it into a big greenhouse. So now you will see later how, what we have more. But thank you for watching at this part. And have a nice day.